Hello, Volusia County team. As you are fully aware, our district-wide character campaign begins in the month of February. This will be a year-round campaign, and each month we will focus on a specific theme. All of the themes selected will center around safety and security of our schools. During this campaign, we will have students, staff, and schools of character. Schools can showcase the theme chosen for the month in their own way. There can be school-wide decorated door contests, poems written by students and staff, skits, etc. Schools will nominate one student and one staff member as a student or a staff of character each month. We are very excited to launch such an important campaign. Our first theme for the month begins in February and will be kindness. We will hear more from Captain Shivers as he shares his thoughts about kindness. Take it away, Captain Shivers. Thank you. So, kindness is one of life's most important virtues. It is not something that can be learned or be taught. Kindness comes from the heart. It's a feeling of compassion and empathy for others. The best part of kindness is that it makes us feel good about ourselves. There are so many benefits of kindness. It can help you feel better, create new relationships, and bring out the best of others. Kindness is also the act of showing concern for the well-being of others. We often find ourselves in situations that make us feel helpless and sad. In these moments, it is important to remember that there are people around us who are willing to help us out. Kindness is a sign of good-heartedness and a way to show other people that you care. It is important to be kind every day and always remember, attitude is contagious. Let's all be kind to each other. Good morning, Beachside students. Today is Monday, February 13th. I'll be back with your daily beach break news. Please stand for the pledge. The lunch choices for today will be having pizza and a salad of Vincent and Obox if they're available. Tomorrow we will be having tangerine chicken. If these items are not available, it will be manager's choice. Please remember to follow Beachside Sea Turtles expectations in the cafeteria. This means voice level one or two, stay seated facing forward, and raise your hand if you need anything. Now to Paige with the weather. I'm Paige with your daily weather report. Today will be sunny. Temperatures will be a high of 66 degrees and a low of 46 degrees. Now to Lucas with special announcements. Good morning.
learning besides sea turtles. I'm Lucas with special announcements. Check out the superintendent's beach side or beach bean stack reading challenge video. In this video, I'm going to show you what students will see with the Volusia County Superintendent Challenge. Currently, I'm logged in as a seventh grade student. As you can see, I have my six to eighth Volusia Superintendent Challenge here. I can click into the challenge to view all the badges and a quick overview of the challenge. By clicking on the badges tab, I can see all of my logging badges and my overall goal of 300 minutes here at the end. I can also post my reviews, view all my badges and my reading log, but I'm going to show you how you're able to earn the badges for the Volusia County Superintendent Challenge. If I click on log reading and activities, I will go ahead and log my minutes. Here I'm able to type in the title of the book that I've read, or I can use the ISBN scanner in order to scan the ISBN of the book to pull in the title and author. I'm going to go ahead and type in the title. If I click on the book title, of course, as you saw, you'll automatically pull in the author as well. I'll then put in my time spent reading. And here is what is important for our elementary students. For those that complete a book, you're going to want to toggle that. Did you finish the book? Because those elementary students are logging books as opposed to our upper level elementary and middle school students who are logging minutes. So be sure to toggle that when you do complete a book. You can also include a review if you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and leave that as no and log my reading. I'll then earn any badges associated with my logged reading. So here, as you can see, I've earned the B badge for the Volusia County Spring Challenge or Superintendent Spring Challenge for reading 30 minutes. I've also earned my first log badge as well. I'll go ahead and X out. And now when I go back to badges, I will see that badge in full color. For this challenge, I also see that I have two activities that I have to complete. These activities are visiting my local library and visiting my media center. So I click on here and as you can see, this is actually a secret code. So I need to go to the local library and get my secret code in order to enter it here. Also, when you're looking at those directions, as it says right here, type in your secret code in all lowercase in the box below. This again, these are case sensitive. So you wanna make sure that you type in that secret code in all lowercase in the box below. That's the same for the visiting your media center. If I click on there again, I have another secret code and I do have to type in that secret code in all lowercase in the box below. Once you've earned your secret code, you'll then type it in here. Once you've typed in your secret secret code, you'll then earn the badge here in full color. Again, I've earned another achievement badge for co completing my first activity. And when I go back to the challenge and I go to activities, that badge will be in full color. Just note that this challenge is actually from February 13th through March 19th, so all of your reading logged needs to be within that date range. Be sure you're completing all of your logged badges and your activity badges as well in order to get those that completion badge at the end and earn prizes throughout. Have fun and keep reading. Kinnies, this week we're focusing on the number two Fab Five rule. Listen and look at the person talking to you and respond in a respectful way. So say if you're in a hallway and you're talking to someone, you should have a list level one or zero because you don't know if someone's like doing a task or having a test in the classroom and you're being too out there. This week is Love Our Bus Week. Make sure you tell your bus driver thank you for all they do. This is for third, fourth, and fifth graders. Do not forget about the Sunshine State Young Reader Award books when you come to media. There's a reading challenge with these books. Students that read at least three to five of these books, depending on your grade level, and pass the rating counts quiz the first time with these books earns a pizza and prize party at the end of the year in media with Miss Lassinger. Now for a house point update. The current readers count Ridley with 36,568. 35,868 black hills. 35,348 for yellow. 35,227 for green. 
35,143 for Lou. Keep it up, houses. This has been an amazing race, and the upcoming Pride Awards should make a huge difference. Keep it up, black team. Remember that today only happens once. Make it count. Make it amazing. Everyone have a great, fantastic day of school. And don't forget the school of character. Remember to be kind to each other all the time. It takes all of us to be a school of character. From all of us at Beach Break News, have a turtle-tastic day.